For many people, buying a new camera is the most exciting part of launching their filmmaking career. For others, it can be a headache. There are so many video cameras on the market with so many features that it's easy to become overwhelmed by the amount of options. I'm here to tell you a dirty little secret. Despite the dozens of camera manufacturers, thousands of camera models, and hundreds of camera blogs telling you otherwise, your camera plays a very small role in determining what your finished video will look like. Picasso is not famous because of the paint he used, Beyonce is not famous because of the microphone she uses, and Spielberg is not famous because of the camera he uses. Almost every new video camera made today is incredible. They all capture high definition footage and their autofocus is amazing. There are five main types of cameras people use to capture video. Smartphones, point and shoot cameras, DSLRs, video cameras, and super fancy pants video cameras. Every camera on this list, even smartphones, is more than enough to make a good video. An ideal camera will have the following two features. First, a tripod mount. This will allow you to screw your camera into a tripod. The good news is that every camera has a tripod mount. The bad news is that smartphones do not have a tripod mount, and you'll need to buy a doohickey that will allow you to mount it on a tripod. The doohickeys cost about seven bucks on Amazon. The second feature you want a camera to have is a microphone input, also called a mic jack. This is a little hole in the camera that will allow you to plug a microphone into the camera. Unfortunately, not all cameras have a microphone input. You don't need a microphone input, but when I talk about audio in video number six, you'll understand why microphone inputs are great to have. The good news is that smartphones do have a microphone input. Now, please don't think you need to own your own camera. There's no need to spend hundreds of dollars on a piece of technology that you'll probably only use a couple of times a year. If you do not currently own a camera, borrow one from a buddy. If you are completely stubborn or need to blow some extra grant money and insist on buying a camera, I recommend the Canon Rebel. They make a new version every couple of years, but they're all essentially the same camera. To illustrate the point that you can make a great video with just about any camera, I'd like to end this video with a commercial that Apple made using the older iPhone 5 several years ago.